वेलकम टू वी लर्न दिस इज सेशन एट पार्ट टू ऑफ आर डी बी एम एस ऑन रिलेशनल डाटा मॉडल इन दिस सेशन वी आर गोइंग टू कवर टॉपिक इंट्रोडक्शन टू नॉर्मलाइजेशन फर्स्ट नॉर्मल फॉर्म सेकेंड नॉर्मल फॉर्म थर्ड नॉर्मल फॉर्म एंड बी सी एन एफ As in previous session, we have studied about anomalies and function dependency, which are creating problem for insertion, deletion, and updation in the data. Through the normalization, we are removing these problems. So, in the normalization that is designing a database, usually data model is to translate into relation schema, and that is very important question is whether their design methodology. or is the process arbitrary so a simple answer of this question is affirmative there are the certain properties that are good database design must process as dedicated by the cord rules the five cord rules are designed here twelve rules through which data is to be much affected so there are the many different ways of designing good database one of the such methodologies is the method involving normalization normalization is the that build around the concept of normal form and normalization reduces redundancy is unnecessary repetition of data and it can cause problem with storage and retrieval of data during this process of normalization dependencies can be identified which can be cause problem during deletion and updation so here normalization theory is based on fundamental notation of dependency so normalization help to simplify this schema of uh, of the tables now the in front of you that mention the slide about the normalization that is the process of decomposing unsatisfactory that is bad relations by breaking up their attributes into small relation basically we are going to cover here very uh, many steps uh, in the in this normalization through which data is make much simpler and the table is so easiest form through which you can easily do insertion updation and deletion so they are the various level which are here is called normal form normal form that is condition using keys and functional dependency of a relation to certify whether a relation schema is in a particular normal form they are one normal form second third bcnf and the four nf that is based on the key and the multi key value dependency basically in this session we are going to cover one two three and the bcnf and the later will be on the next session we will cover but let's see about the starting of these label in the normal form the first normal form that this allow composite attribute and multi valid attribute and nested relation so here attribute whose value of individual tuple are non atom atomic that is considered to be part of definition of relation हमारे फर्स्ट नॉर्मल फॉर्म में जब बहुत सारी कंसिस्टेंसी होती है टेबल में प्रॉब्लम्स होती हैं डिडेंसीज होती है जैसे वो फर्स्ट नॉर्मल फॉर्म में एंटर होती हैं इट रिमूव हेयर मल्टी वैल्यूड एट्रीब्यूट्स लेट सी दिस डायग्राम देर इज अ डायग्राम ऑफ डिपार्टमेंट टेबल दिस डिपार्टमेंट टेबल इन दिस टेबल दे आर द फोर कॉलम वन इज डिपार्टमेंट नेम डिपार्टमेंट नंबर डिपार्टमेंट मैनेजर्स एंड एस एस एन एंड डिपार्टमेंट लोकेशन Uh, it is very easily to clear you here. Department number. If you know the D number, you can extract the name and D uh, manager assistant. And if you know that, you can find out the as well D location. Next is in this diagram. When we enter in the data, the table. You see here. If a table, a uh, department in that research here, department number is five, and the uh, D man assistant number is given here. But the location are many. so but other cell no have on a single single value but you see that in this cell contain three value so this can create the problem here so in the one normal form 
it does not allow a single cell multi value it allow there should be only one value so it convert it into the one normal form like this the the following c diagram is the under one normal form below above a uh, b diagram that is below, uh, before the one normal form as it enter the one normal form that apply uh, its rule that the uh, it the multi value should be in uh, separate rows so here research is to be repeated at three time as compared to three value you know but the main thing of the one normal form is that one cell should not contain must not contain more than one value so it repeat again and again and that is here three times but you see here again there the problem arises data duplicacy start here redundancy start here you see this this data of d name d number and d major is in see that this contain data three times so redundancy arises here so it can be create problem that is to be removed in other another level or another normal form uh again it's uh, here is the one more example taken here on the employee project and the employee number and hour is given here and the employee project uh, shown here then the corresponding project number and the hour so it further uh, it's divide according to remove their uh, duplicacy problem because there arise uh, one is null values also given here which is unknown and you see that shown here the project one contain only ss number and e name and project 2 contain ssn number p number and r that make help to easy to use here rather than in the one table then in uh, in the second normal form the second normal form says when when data must be passed through one normal form it use the concept of functional dependencies the primary key aapko bataya jaise ki hamare one normal form ka uh, rule hai ki ek cell mein multi values nahi honi chahiye but second normal form says that every table should contain a primary key kyunki aapne dekha ki first normal form mein agar hum ek cell se multi value hatate hain to duplicacy arise ho rahi hai redundancies arise ho rahi hai which can again create the problem so us problem ko remove karne ke liye second normal form create the primary key if you create the primary key on a particular column of the table then it stop this duplicacy primary key means here contain a unique value in a one table you can create only one primary key aap ek table mein kisi bhi ek column pe aap primary key laga sakte hain jaise ki example aap jante hain agar main kisi bhi uh, university ki baat karte hain to student ka details hoti hain uh, uske corresponding student ki details mein tables banate hain to usme aap dekhenge roll number student ka unique hota hai that is not repeated for any other student cannot contain the same roll number so that is make here primary key that's why it given the unique number only so second normal form rules say that every table should contain a primary key primary key attribute that is the number of the primary key that is defined by symbol k and functional dependency that we have already observed like this because we are creating primary key means some dependencies arise if you know the primary key only then you can enter the data so like this dependencies arise the function dependency that removal of an attribute from y means function when does not hold any more next is the example of this is the second normal form that ssn number and project number so hour is full function dependencies since the ssn number is based on, uh, can extract hour or project number how much hour it's hold and if you know ssn number and project number also they have the e name that is not a null uh, that is not a full function dependency so it is called partial dependency basically we are talking about uh, what is full function dependency and partial function dependency agar hamara data pura aap dikh rahe hain is table mein agar ssn m aur p number aapko pata hai aur hours hamare isse se extract ho rahe hain so this is full function dependency not ssn because our Uh, hours or not the project numbers are hold here but if we talk about here the e num is uh, that take out employee name is not full functional dependency it is called partial dependency because that can also be extracted by ssn uh, by ssn that also be hold here so a relation schema r is second normal form if every non prime attribute are fully 
functionally dependent on the primary key that is fully functional dependent on the primary key so r can be decomposed into two normal formulation via the process of second normalization i hope it will be very clear to you let's see one again more diagram if something uh, is uh, to clear you more uh, this diagram contain uh, the table schema and structure table that show here ssn number and p number project number if you know these two value you can extract our if you know only ssn number we can take out employee name if we know here project number we can extract project name and as well project location you see here three functional dependencies are here and we convert into two normal form we divide this all dependency by separating the table now it's very helpful uh, not multi dependency should be here if there are many dependencies to be here uh, again the problem arises as functional dependency one it separate table according to that functional dependency two according to the value that extract from it separated again that functional dependency three through which we can extract data make the separate table this was the about two normalization form next we are uh, covering here the third normal form as the uh, third normal form enter data when it must pass through the second normal form here the third normal form that is transitive uh, transitive functional dependency if there is set of attribute like z that are neither a primary or candidate key both x that point to z and y point to z hold example that say that uh, transitivity means you can say uh, x a b c let's see uh, let's see the example a b c we take the value a uh, b depend on the a if data is extracted by a then b is get value and c depend on b till b didn't get the value c can't get so indirectly c depend on a that's this diagram here x y by taking z and another example here shown ssn number that uh, here the d manages the number depend on ssn that is transitive of function dependency and uh, d number that based on ssn and d uh, manager ssn based on d number that hold by uh, d ssn uh, number and ssn e name can extract by ssn number that is non transitive since there is set of attribute where the ssn extract x and x extract e name this called here transitivity this kind of dependency have to be removed in the third normal form there is a relation schema r in third normal form it uh, i already explained you should uh, must be in second normal form and there is non prime attribute and the transitivity depend on the primary key uh, before this i would like there the block diagram Uh, how the third normal form normal form is to be removed here? There the data as we was passed. This is the second normal form. After second normal form, you can enter into the third normal form. Here the uh, assistant through the assistant number, we can extract employee name, employee date, address, and department number. If you know the department number, you can extract department name and department manager assistant. So this form here transitivity that is removed here in the third normal form. it break down the table again from the department number which making the transitivity uh, from the separate table the first table in ed1 and the second is ed2 that one through all value depend on ssn1 that is fully function dependency here is also fully function dependency all value just depend on d number so uh, kind this we can make the uh, table more easiest form uh, this was the uh, basically again show the uh, dependencies as we shown in the previous example how we can remove it from the next example hope it will be very clear to you from the last example next is the bcnf bcnf full forms of the boyle's chord normal form when data is passed from three normal form it must enter into the boyle's chord normal form that is the relation schema r in bcnf if whenever functional dependency x tends to a means hold value in relation r then x is a super key of r and here each normal form is strictly stronger than the previous one so here every two normal form relation is in one normal form every three normal form relation is to two normal form 
and every three B C N F fraction is in three normal form. जैसे आपको बताया अगर हमारे टू एन एफ में तो पहले वन एन एफ से पास होकर आना चाहिए थ्री एन एफ में तो वो सेकेंड एन एफ से होना चाहिए अगर हम बी सी एन एफ की बात करते हैं तो वो थर्ड नॉर्मल फॉर्म से क्लियर होना चाहिए देर एग्जिस्ट रिलेशन दैट आर इन थ्री नॉर्मल फॉर्म बट नॉट इन बी सी एन एफ सो हेयर गोल टू दैट हैव रिलेशन इन बी सी एन एफ और इन थ्री एन एफ बी सी एन एफ द मेन रोल इज द कंटेन द डाटा इज बेस्ड ऑन द कैंडिडेट की बेसिक हेयर If you know uh, a data can be entered in the table, if you know the primary key, but if you don't know have, so how can you enter the data in this? So on the basis of uh, candidate key, we can extract the data. This is the example of block diagram that shown in front of you. Here the lots taken here that contain property ID, country name, lot and area. You see here the property. Through if you know this property, you can extract country name, lot and area. And if you know the country name, you can extract lot as well. Then you can extract property ID and area. And if you know the area, you can extract country name. So, so uh, that is the one. So if you know the area, you can extract country name. This dependence is to be uh, make separate table on the basis of candidate key because this is not a primary key. And we make the separate table on with the help of candidate key uh, and make here it is primary and the all. Uh, Lot one, the value of the primary key depend on make a separate table. So like this, we remove the dependencies and make uh, solve the problem here in the BCNF. This is the example in the taken by the tech uh, in which the student record course and instructor are taken here. Uh, here the student course that extract the value of instructor and the instructor take take out the course and the decomposing into the two schema, student instructor. student course course instructor student course and course instructor and instructor student like this on the basis of candidate key we make decomposition into the two schema through which data can be extracted easily this is the example shown here again one of the bcnf like book title and author name book type list price author affil and the publisher are taken in the book table and here the functional dependencies are book title publisher are can be extracted by the book title and the book type can be extracted by it list price can extract by book type and author affiliation can take out by author name so these were dependency in this table that is to be removed by the here bcnf this is the exercise in front of you that you can try it by yourself what is normal form in the relation and explain bcnf that's all thank you so much uh, happy learning We learn.